What's going on YouTube? This is Chris Korea 42 and just wanted to make a video. Uh, I know it was difficult for me to figure it out, but I finally did. Uh, what I'm going to show you today is how to get the Sense 3.0 lock screen uh, without having to root your phone. Yep, without having to root your phone and it's as easy as a couple steps here. So here we go. What you're going to do is click on the Android Market. And I already have something in here, but what we're going to do is go to the Android Market, click on Search, and search Magic Locker. Once you search Magic Locker, there's something called Magic Locker Main. You're going to go ahead and install that. Download. Accept and download. Alright, so once it downloads, it's going to install. I'm going to go ahead and click on the home button. And once I click on the home button, I'm getting this uh, message here. It says complete action using HTC Sense and or Magic Locker set as default. So it's very important that you set the, click on the little default there and click on Magic Locker. Very important that you do that. If not, it will not work. Alright, so here's a couple of some instructions, but I'll kind of walk you through all this. Alright, so by default there's one theme that's installed called, called Lost Robot. I don't really like that one, so to go get more themes what you're going to do is click right here where it says get more themes. I don't know if you guys can see that. But it's right there, get more themes. And right here it says Android for free. I'm going to go ahead and click on there. Uh, this one's pretty cool too. I'm going to just download this, download and accept. I'm going to go back one and I'm going to download a few more. So HTC Sense 3 Pro Magic. This is the one that I want to do. I'm going to go ahead and download, accept and download. And there's another one that I'll show you too, which is the iPhone 4. Oh no, that one costs money. We don't want to do that one. There's another one that's free. Uh, let me see. Oh, here we go. Here goes Samsung GS, which is pretty cool. I'm going to download and accept that. Alright, so once I do that, I'm letting all that download in the background. I'm going to click on my home screen. I'm going to go ahead and click on the Applications button. So that's this little button down here. Alright, so it installed two icons. One says Magic Locker, and the other one says Magic Locker Settings. So, before we go into there, well, let's go into there first. Alright, so you're going to see all this information. You're going to have three tabs at the top, Settings, Themes, and Customization. Go to Themes. And if you take a look, there's still not any in there. So I know that we just downloaded three of them. Don't worry. What we're going to do is go out of everything, go back home to your main screen, click on your applications, and what you're going to do is you're going to find everything that you downloaded. So here it says Android 4.0, and at the bottom it's going to tell you do you want to install it. So I'm going to go ahead and click Install. All right, so if you take a look, it installed, and it popped up right here under the themes. So I'm going to go back and do the same thing for the others. So you got to look for whatever theme that you downloaded. Alright, so here goes Samsung Galaxy S. I'm going to install it. And it popped up again here. And let's do that one more time for the Sense 3.0. Install this theme. Alright, so now that I have all those installed, I'm going to go ahead and click on one. So what I want to do is I want to install the Sense 3.0 Pro. So I just tap on it once and it says, do you want to apply it? Hit apply. Now it's going to ask you theme customization. This theme is customizable. Would you like to customize it now? I'm going to go ahead and hit yes. So these are the four icons that come by default. So what you can do is you can click, so I don't want my music. I'm going to tap on that and it's going to give you all your applications that you have. Uh, let's just say I want Chase. And then for the phone, I don't want the phone. Let's just say I want Engadget. Alright, so once I do that, I can just click out of here. And once we do that, lock your screen. And click it again. And voila. Here's the Sense 3.0 screen. Pretty cool. Alright, so of course, you can just click out of it to unlock it. Or two, I just powered it on and powered it off again. Here we go. If you want like a specific app, you just click and drag it inside and it'll take you directly to that app. Pretty cool. 
All right, let me just show you one more, which is, and what I'm doing is going to the apps, go to Magic Locker Settings, go to Themes, and let's go ahead and click on Samsung Galaxy. So here it's asking, do you want to apply the theme? I hit Apply, and of course you can customize the icons if you want. I'm going to go ahead and hit No, and voila, by default, here's the unlock screen, here's your messages, and here's the phone call. So hopefully this is easy. If not, uh, please uh, let me know. You can post a comment and please rate my video if you liked it. And if you have any questions, just post them and I'll answer them for you as quickly as possible. Thanks.